Hey guys, um, just got back from the mailbox and it has finally, finally arrived. About time, right? <laughs> I know, I know. If you watch mid-level media, he basically told you guys why there was a delay. Um, but uh, we got three titles here from Scream Factory Shocktober sale back from the beginning of October. Um, I got three Blu-rays, all upgrades from my DVDs. Um, I'm pretty excited for these because they've they dropped down dropped down to 15 bucks a piece. So I was like, yeah, I'm snagging those. Without further ado, I'm gonna dive right in here. Uh, first thing here, first thing I got is some cardboard. We have the invoice, which I just showed you. And then finally, the, what's in here? Yes, it's all horror, obviously. Hmm. One, one of them has a slipcover too, at least. All right. So that down there. All right. Uh, I'm just gonna go in the way that they, they, they put them in here. Um, this movie was okay. Well, actually, sorry, I take that back. It was more than okay. It was pretty good. I like the first one better. Uh, this is part of a trilogy of movies. Um, the third one doesn't have any really any relation to the other two. But um, this one is Urban Legend Final Cut. Um, I do have this on DVD as part of a box set with the other um, with the other two. And I already have Urban Legend on Blu-ray from I don't remember if it was the Scream Factory version or it was the uh, original version from Columbia Pictures. I don't know. I have to go look. I don't remember. But yeah, excited to have this one. I need to go back and rewatch this one because I don't really remember the ending of it. Um, but yeah. Good movie. I recommend it. Okay. Next one here is... I don't believe I've I don't believe I've actually seen this movie before. Um, if I have, it's been a very very long time, like over twenty years ago. I know I'm old, <laughs> uh, but uh, this is uh, Stephen King's Graveyard Shift. Um, I do have the DVD upstairs in a box set with like the Dead Zone and a couple other movies. So, um, look, looking forward to watching this one as well. Um, this one has Brad Dorif in it. He's right there. Um, if you don't know who Brad Dorif is, he he voices uh, Chucky in all the Child's Play movies except for the remake. That was Mark Hamill. Um, but yeah, and and he was also in the first uh, Urban Legend. He played the guy at the gas station at the beginning of the movie. That was pretty funny. But yeah, looking forward to this one here. And then finally, another Stephen King. Um, this is Pet Cemetery 2. I know this one... This one's... From what I remember, this one I did enjoy more than the original. Um, but... We'll see. Um, this one is directed by Mary Lambert. She... From what I remember, she did direct the first one too, right? Right, guys? Uh, I don't have the first one. I don't have the first movie in front of me right now. It's upstairs in my horror collection but yeah um i have to go back and watch this one as well i vaguely remember this i watched it on tv probably probably one i shouldn't have um back when i was a kid but yeah you yeah, there we go there's that uh, this one has edward furlong in it and anthony edwards so looking forward to revisiting that one as well and that is everything from in here. Um, it's kind of weird because it doesn't say Scream Factory or Shout Factory on the box. Um, it says, here, I'll show you, I'll show you what it says here. It says Clark and Riggs. I don't know what that is. That's, might be, I don't know, that might be the uh, distribution center or whatever. I don't know in Kentucky though but well, that's everything I have from Scream Factory um, I didn't go too crazy 
I could have. There was a lot of tiles I wanted, but I was like, eh, I'm just going to narrow it down to three and just be done with it. Uh, that's everything I have to show off uh, today. I do have a package coming from Cinema Sickness at some point. I snagged uh, a little bundle of horror movies from him. Uh, we'll see when it gets here. I don't know when we'll get here, but that'll probably be in my next video, though. But uh, take care, guys. See you guys next time. Bye, guys.